Boom. Shark Tooth. Yeah. Brought to you by the, the Potash Corp. Thanks for that. It's got some uh, text on the paper. Sharks belong to a very old family of creatures. Yada, yada, yada. Primary remains of ancient sharks are their hard, durable teeth. This was found in a phosphate mine. Which apparently Aurora Corporation has something to do with. Pretty neat though. In one cache, I found Jack Squat. And then I looked on the other side, and there's teeny tiny writing. And I got in close. You found Jack Squat. Nothing. Not a nil. Zero. Zip. Zilch. So, little laughs from the geocachers to the geocachers. Always appreciate it. This lovely little charm. Actually, it's a pin. And, alright, so it's just kind of cheap costume jewelry. I think what drew me to it was the old Dungeons and Dragons vibe. Just, uh, it seemed like a treasure, so I kept it. Uh, so keeping that in mind, you can imagine how I felt when I found this guy. Gave him a polish for the video debut. But yeah. Hopefully it's not a cursed item. Definitely caught my fancy. Still going on, the whole D&D thing. I found somebody else's figurine. Uh, again, nice. This is a proper one, this is not plastic. I just blasted the thing the camera was on. It's a cleric of some sort, maybe. I see armor and some sort of mace. You've been caught red-handed. This is a travel coin that has been gone for I don't know how long because my friend's little niece snagged it when they were when they were casually geocaching. So now it's up to me to put it back into play. And the final piece, the cornerstone of this third video in the compilation of things I found in geocaches. WinFax Pro. Hassle-free faxing. For Windows 95 and Windows NT. Brought to you by the good people at Symantec. And you know what? I never actually opened it up. Oh. I don't know what I was expecting. A message. Another disc. A surprise birthday present? Oh man, that would have been nice. Uh, anyway, now I'm going to put everything away again. i got to figure something out. I can't keep doing that every time. As my cumulative crap grows and grows. I'm not, I repeat, not going to be one of those people that has a bookshelf full of various knickknacks they found out in the world. I'm not. 